2016 Ford F-250. This is a gas burner. Nice clean truck. Um, it's very evident that it's had a good life and has not been roughed up. So in the spread, bed liner looks good all around. The trim in the back looks really nice. Um, sitting on 17 inch tires, they're new. It's that way you can see that yourself. Nice little fresh little marks there. The, um, they're 17s, but they, they look a lot bigger than that. <laughs> they really do. Paint is beautiful. Uh, the chrome one here, look at this, really nice. Lenses are excellent. This thing is just a cream puff. I'm, I'm really liking it. Uh, no damages. This is something we see. You know, you get those bug chips, rocks, it starts to fade or whatever. Super Duty logo, nice and clean. No rock chips. There's no nothing that's been sit here, but you know, this is where we see them at, is right throughout here. Real pretty chrome bumper. Um, this here, maybe that could use a little touch up of paint that'd make it look, you know, really sharp. But um, exterior wise, definitely very sharp. The, even here, this has not been faded. Um, to me, they probably probably kept it inside of a of a barn or something, just because there is no fading on this. On the backs of these, really sharp and clean. Um, here is your uh, limited warranty, so you do know it's got that. We can go over that. Here's your little gas, so you can see inside of there. Underneath looked really nice. I was I was impressed with it. Let's go ahead and do a little undershot. We always like to see that. You're gonna see your muffler and whatnot, does it? But the rest of it looks good. Looks how it's supposed to be. Um, all these are in good shape. There's no peeling or cracking around our stickers. Once again, logo's nice. The rear here, you can lock it, unlock it. Let me just, hang on just a second. Well, give me a sec. There we go. Trying to get it to drop. Has a uh, Ford mat that's in here, a spray in bed liner. The bed liner, the spray in is in really good shape too. Uh, that's the, and look. Okay, not in bad shape at all. This is what I really like to see in this, because this is not what you see in these trucks. You just look, you know. So, let's go ahead and shut this back up. And you can put a top on it, got flex fuel. Uh, once again, this logo is in good shape. We're really trying to, you know, show everything. There's a small mark in the bed. It's right here. The, you know, could use some touch-up paint on it. Uh, the backs of these, what would you see, T, that they weren't all tore up or anything like that. And then there was a small oak spot right here okay but i think that this here could be buffed out because it's mostly just on the clear coat and that would get rid of that that image of rubbing but on the exterior other than that that's the only things that i saw we're going to go ahead and look on the inside once again these videos, videos. um are just it's just to show the condition rubber mats all the way around rubber mats on rubber floors i mean this person that right there will tell you that they were a cleanophobe uh back seats are nice all the mats look really good it probably came in like this because the guys in the cleanup, um, they can be questionable when it comes to cleaning these kind of mats. So, uh, but I want to show you that headliner too, so you can see that it's in good shape. Um, that these guys, they look really good. Oh, here's something you need to see. Okay, first of all, this thing is nice. So there's no uh, shoe prints. A lot of times we get rocks um, on these work trucks and they just get tore up. Look at that. Another thing is, this is a big teller of the previous owners. These get full of stuff and it scratches them and they get discolored and they get marked up and you don't see that um in this truck okay let's go ahead and hop up in here and see what we have so the steering is got a little bit of weighing but that's kind of normal to this type of steering um i wouldn't call it excessive it's very normal you can put a steering thing on there um, if you wanted to all right and all the stuff that matters up here uh we're going to go over in it Runs nice and smooth, no shimmy, no shake up here. The, uh, I'm gonna turn the fan off, so. So, we've got um, your lining, if you wanna listen to your own music, you got your own little port here. Uh, nice little bin here, both these look good. They're not messed up or anything like that. Um, I tried to go over everything we can, integrate trailer brake controller. We've got your four wheel drive that's right here. This is nice and clean, uh, no weird dirt right here this is this is the the telltale sign uh inside the bins in good shape i'm gonna flip this up here okay another little spot that's underneath here this is clean no stains or drip marks or anything all the seats um are fantastic 
And uh, as far as inside, uh, definitely doesn't look like any pets or smoke has ever been in here. Nice big bin that's over here. Got your books, all your fun stuff. Um, so, and then over here we got your cruise control, um, which I'm a huge fan of cruise control. I mean, we do still get trucks that don't have it on it, and I just don't even know how you do it. And it does have that tow haul mode. Nice big bin up here, so you can throw that junk up there, and that way it will reflect to the sun. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I'm going to give this truck a really strong praise. Um, we're going to give it probably a 95, 96 on the exterior and probably 96, 97 on the inside. 